Class Training, your computer training specialists. And hi everybody, it's me again, Mark Mannering from Class Training with another three tips in three minutes, more or less. I'm just gonna focus on some great calendar shortcuts I use in Outlook. And the first one is a great shortcut I use all the time to jump across to dates in the future or in the past. I don't just click the calendars in the top left there to go across to the next month, the next month. I just go Control G. Control G for go. And in the date box that uh, pops up, you don't type a date, you don't select a date. You just type in something like six months. I type in six months, I press enter. And it jumps across there to the 30th of November, which is a Friday, six months. You can go control G, four weeks, for example. And that's always from today's date, four weeks. So it jumps ahead from today's date, uh, 27th of June, whatever is uh, there on the Wednesday. Okay, what about that uh, course we did, Mark, about uh, six months ago? I go Control G, six months and then ago, press enter, and it jumps back and says, yep, that was the 30th of November on a Thursday. No, nothing there, and uh, away we go. Control G can help you. Another great one is to show some days in a row or days that might not be next to each other. So, for example, if I click the 4th of June here on the far left, I go the 4th of June and I say, let's look at that in a day view. I then hold down the control key and I click days that aren't next to each other. So the 11th, the 18th, 25th and 2nd of July there. And you'll notice across the top, I've got four or five days that aren't consecutive, that aren't one after the other. I can look at the next four or five Mondays and schedule some meetings just on those Mondays or whatever it might be. And there's my five Mondays in a row. So someone says, Mark, can we organize some courses over the next five Mondays? It's not a recurring appointment, but I want to uh, schedule some uh, meetings or whatever over those next five Mondays. Here's a great shortcut, the third tip. Okay, now to put the same appointment or calendar entry across those five Mondays, just put in the first one. We just go click and drag like that. I'm just gonna type in uh, zero course. Now to copy that to the other days, you all know how you can just go click and move. I can just drag that around and so on, but this time I'm gonna copy it. So you, instead of dragging by itself, hold down the control key. Drag that appointment over to the next day. Keep dragging the appointment with the control key held down and I've made some exact copies so I can uh, schedule those appointments over those five or six Mondays, whatever they are. Okay, we cover a lot more uh, than this in our Outlook course. So look for that, uh, the time management uh, based Outlook course. It's on our website. Mark Mannering signing off. Uh, see you again next time. Thanks a lot. Bye.